We're talking with Greg Smith, candidate for city attorney. His campaign website is gregsmith2013.com. Uh, Greg, uh, when my when uh, when Carmen Trutanich ran for city attorney the first time, he pledged on this show repeatedly that he supported the right of the city controller to do audits within uh, elected officials' departments as well. And then he reneged on that promise. I mean, that's why I have a huge problem with Trutanich, because he lied to me to my face repeatedly. Uh, you know, we even heard rumors that he was bailing on that uh, as early as election night. We had him back on the show before he took the oath of office. He doubled down on the pledge, and then he completely ran away from it. And and this is part of the problem. The city of Los Angeles has got severe financial problems, and uh, the, it, there's, there's a. Do you believe that the city controller should be able to audit the books of the city attorney's office? Uh, let's start with that question first. Yeah, let me. Before I say that, let me tell you. Uh, you know, I supported Carmen Trutanich before he came into. I office. did too. I did too. And and I believe the man. And one of the first questions I asked him because I'm a military veteran. I served during the Vietnam War on a Navy submarine. And I asked him, were you in the military? And he told me he was in the Coast Guard. And I found out subsequently that that was just a flat lie. So uh, this is the kind of thing that uh, apparently comes from Mr. Trutanich uh, nonstop. As far as the city controller, there's, uh, unfortunately, there's already well, there's been a case that's already decided that uh, the city controller does not have the legal right to go in and uh, take a look at the records of the city attorney's office. But let me make this pledge right here and right now that um, I welcome anyone who's in the city of controller's office to come into the city attorney's office to look at everything, look it over, uh, and let me know what we can do to do things better. Uh, my whole thing about becoming city attorney is to work in a collaborative effort with all branches of city government. I want to make things work. I want to see Los Angeles come back to the way it used to be that I remember it when it was a great city. So uh, in a short answer to your question, uh, legally I'm not required to have the controller come in, but uh, I welcome him or her to come in and audit uh, to their heart's content. Greg Smith, candidate for city attorney, campaign website, gregsmith2013.com. Election day is Tuesday. Thanks so much for your time. Uh, good luck on Election Day. I appreciate it. Thank you very much. Okay. And, of course, we have special Election Night coverage here at KBC. John Phillips will be in from 6 to 9 p.m. live coverage as the returns start coming in. And we'll recap everything here on McIntyre in the morning uh, on Wednesday.